Well, TGIF everyone, thank God it's Friday. Yes, I'm excited. Yes, I'm happy to be sharing with you this coin that Martin the Silver Trader has sent in. If you don't know what this coin is right here, well then you've probably had your head in the sand for a little bit. And I'll tell you what, if you want one of these, you better act really quick. I mean, super quick, because as of yesterday, which was Thursday, today's Friday, uh, I do know the number count, which is, well, very low, less than how many on my hand. So any regulars, please get in contact with Martin the Silver Trader immediately via email, and then there you go. But if you're new to the channel anyway, I'm John Armas, otherwise known as Ace Bullion. Um, you can find the links, so please click on the links down below under this video for Martin the Silver Trader, who sends me in lots of coins to review. You'll find a link to the Precious Metal Forum, which is, well, growing rapidly. And there's going to be some interesting stuff that I'm going to be announcing on there, but not here on YouTube because, well, it really is a forum thing. And number three, you'll find a link to my own website where if you've been looking for any of those uh, Simpson coins at all, every single Simpson coin is listed on my website right now. And I do ship worldwide. So... There you go. Let's crack on and see what this is all about, shall we? I'm excited. TGIF! So this is what we're showing off today. It is the 2024, and for some reason I keep saying 2014. I don't know why. Lunar Dragon, one ounce silver, black proof. Now, yeah, there we go. I'm just stunned by this. And look at that as an image. We got a barcode, we get the box. Anyway, let's open this thing up and we're gonna find out what it's all about because it's something worth sharing. Now, it comes from Downies. And that being said, you're gonna know it's gonna come with one of these, well, already dusty. I've never opened this yet dusty cloths I mean, they just come it, it comes i don't know it attracts dust like there's no tomorrow you look at it and bingo bango you have dust you know so what you do is <laughs> and also has a typical flaw as well but there you go hold on there we go so we open it we open it we open it we open it ta-da and we get a lovely wooden presentation I'm just going to move the cloth out the way. Now, I can already tell straight away because I, I just felt it again. For whatever reason, it's rattled during transit and somehow the case or the coin has come loose. I could tell you that now. And yeah, it has. So we'll get on to that in a minute. But the coin just sits in here really nicely like so. And I'll be sharing that in a minute. So underneath this lovely um, a styrofoam or whatever foam bit. There here we go. We're going to have the uh, certificate of authenticity. Now it's, it's disguised rather well, actually. So just know that that's where it is. And I'm going to do this off camera just as I speak. But uh, yep, here we go. That way I can pull it out with ease and without any problems. So Single-sided certificate of authenticity. It states here the 2024 20, uh, Lunar uh, Dragon. And on it, and I'm going to block this off because I haven't decided if I'm going to keep it or not. Uh, it decides here of all the details. So we have three nines fine purity. Year of issue is 2024. It's black proof. It has a mintage of just 888. Now, why is that significant? You, you know, we've seen a lot of mintages with just 888. Well, Google it, actually. You know, the significant 888 as a number is karma. And that's what it represents. It represents good karma. I was unaware of that. It is a coin. It has an issuing body of Nui. Well, they've been issuing a lot of stuff anyway, so there we go. And uh, yeah, it is just incredible. So I'm gonna put this away and we're gonna focus a bit more on the coin because that's what you're here to see. And that's what I'm here to show you. 
And I do have my gloves already. I'm not sure if I need them, but we'll see. Pops out like that with the tab. And by the way, it is a really lovely, this is a really black darkened box. It's gorgeous, actually. I, I, I find it amusing. We're going to start off with the uh, side, which is face down. And rightly so, because this is not the image you want really showing up on your, um, you know, <laughs> your image. But of course, there's King Charles III. Um, as you can see, they're issuing uh, body is Nui. Uh, 2024, one dollar, one ounce, three ounce fine silver, and there we go. There's a fantastic image of King Charles, one that doesn't have carpet burn like the Royal uh, Mint has done. Um, one that is actually designed really well. Uh, Jody Clark, the designer, of course, has made this portrait. As you can see there, look at that. That's what the JC is, and it is just phenomenal. I'll tell you what as well, what you don't really notice, and why I, this is a little bit special than most King Charles portraits, all this is black. Yeah, that's black, everyone. That's not light play, that's black. And, uh, yeah, it's nice. <laughs> uh, it does have a reeded edge going all the way along the side of it, and weeby jeebies, look at that. Holy moly, mother of all molies. That is one gorgeous coin. So let me uh, pop off, uh, pop on my gloves and we're gonna have a look at it and I'll let you see all the details up close because that's the only way I think you're gonna be able to see them as fantastic as it is. So it's the year of, the lunar year of the dragon and uh, one second, here we go. All right, so. As I was pulling it off the capsule, I noticed because I was having a hard time actually focusing on it, why it was so bad like this? And then I suddenly realized, wait a minute, that's the dust, or not the dust, but it's the felt from inside of this. So it's just a little bit of felt that's on here. But uh, I was wondering, I was like, why is it, why, why, why is my hand turning a little bit black? And I was like, that's a little bit odd and bizarre. So here's uh, the King Charles side, as I said, and uh, it is actually really nice. We'll take a look along the side here and the reeded edge. And yeah, you get two little dots right at the bottom. In fact, actually, yep. And then look at that. Now this is black and all the way gold. Look at those scales. Look at those details. There's no other color apart from gold and black on here. Um, I mean, uh, the silver, I guess, is coming through on some bits, but wow, for one ounce silver coin, this is surely hitting the spots. Now, I know at first, you know, at least on the images, I wasn't really too sure whether or not this was going to be the same as the B uh, that Downies had done earlier because it didn't really portray a lot of detail. However, how wrong am I? Look at those scales. Look at just the body. I mean, everything that embodies a dragon is on this coin right here. The teeth, the facial uh, features, the symbol down below. With, you know, he's holding on to the pearl. I say he, it is holding on to the pearl. Uh, look at the claws, and just like any reptile, you can just see how spectacular it is. Inside the ear, you could just see all the details. I mean, really, it is remarkable. So, this, I mean, this is a proof coin, it's a black and proof coin, and it is something that I am just kind of blown away with. I have to ask what your thoughts and opinions are on this and, uh, you know, to ask you to leave your comments down below because I am stunned. And, wowzers, this is one of those things, yeah, I only could say wowzers. It, it just is beautiful. So, leave your thoughts and opinions down below 
let me know what you think of this coin right here. And uh, yeah, I will see you guys on Monday. I might just have to stare at this for a few more hours because holy cow, it really is a very special coin, even the Charles side. And I know a lot of people won't, <laughs> won't agree with that statement, but wowzers. Okay, that's enough. I'm out of here. Have a good weekend, folks. Bye for now.